All right, hey guys, welcome again to Fire Alarms and such, and it is time to do something pretty groundbreaking. Two panels, one system, connected to form one super panel. Oh, not really. It, it, I don't know. I connected my two panels. I thought we'd try it. <laughs> um, so the way I actually have it connected is it's only a one-way connection. What that means is that my 4010 here, I have two wires that come in from the relay, from one of the auxiliary rela relays, ugh, set at alarm. And it is currently hooked up to the normally open relay, which means that the circuit is not completed. And that wire, if we follow it, all the way around, all the way up, here we are. Goes up to initiating spot on my uh, Silent Night 5208. And that's hooked up to an initiation zone, zone nine. The title on it is still OSNY Tamper from when I did that tamper switch video. I just, I didn't want to change it because it's kind of annoying. But, so if my 4010 here, if that goes into alarm, it will also send this panel into alarm. If this panel goes into alarm, this panel doesn't care. I would hook it up to an ID net spot if I had an extra module laying around, but I don't because all mine are being used with my various pulse stations and junk. So it's a one-way communication, but this basically could be like, oh, look at me using simplex addressable devices on a conventional style at night panel. Yeah, look at me. Fabulous, ain't it? Um, so you'll just see, I'll, I'll pull the pulse station on the 4010, the true alerts will sound, and then the silent night will go into alarm. And it's still the advanced, low frequency sounder, white true alert, and then I got a new true alert today. Um, this is another two wire version, so they are actually now in sync with a working strobe, and they actually sound right and sound together, both on temporal 3, 30 candela, 30 candela, 135 cam dollar. So, let's pull this on device one. Everything is silenced. Let me acknowledge the panel over here. So, panel is silenced. True alerts are flashing. Those are off. The classic over at my desk is flashing. And so the panels went off together. So, I'm going to reset this panel. I'm not going to reset this one yet because that one resets way faster than this one. And the first time I did it, I reset this one. And that one at the same time and walked away and because this one was still resetting the relay hadn't reset yet and was closed and this one reset and was accepting alarms and went back into alarm and scared the living bejesus out of me because i was not ready for a low frequency sounder to go off mildly terrifying i should say that that panel's reset we will come over here and i want to reset from the key switch just because we haven't done it in a while I mean, I know we just did it on the last wall test, but I, I, I love this key switch. So, if you're wondering, why on God's green earth would someone want to connect panels together? Well, I'm going to give you a real life example. In my school district, um, we have seen some rapid growth. We have gone from a rural farming community. I'm six generations deep in this town, so my family has seen all of it. Um, we went from a very rural farming community with like one school to now a suburban area with about 20,000 people and about six school buildings. In 2000, they built this new campus and it was this beautiful school, state of the art. It was just absolutely beautiful, wonderful. Um, it had a simplex panel in it, uh, running true alerts on March time. And then maybe five years after that, they built another building. 
an exact, it was so cool, an exact copy of that building just mirrored and on the other side of it is they brought, they bought the property that was behind it. And so it's the exact same building just mirrored, but they weren't connected. There was about a 20, 30 foot gap between two hallways that connect, that uh, separated the buildings and then a little sidewalk. So they kept their fire system separate because, you know, they're, they're separate buildings. But then maybe eight years after that new building was built, they added on like two more classrooms and that connected the two buildings, which means they had to connect their fire systems. The old building had a simplex panel with true alerts on March time. The new building had a firelight panel with Gentex Commander 3's Code 3 mechanical horn. And they're like, hmm, we got to connect these panels because now it went from two fire systems to one. So this is something like what they did. They went to the relays, to initiation zones, and back over. So yeah, um, I got bored. I was like, you know what? Let's do something pretty groundbreaking. Create one big mega system. And so I did. So yeah, two panels are connected now. It's not going to be like this forever. I mean, look at this mess. Maybe one day I'll actually fish a wire through and actually connect the panels. But sometimes I like them separate. So, I don't know. Once I get another module, I'll try and connect the silent light panel to this. So if the silent light goes into alarm, this will go into alarm. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. And as always, have a wonderful day.